New Year's Day. Two firefighters are injured battling a five alarm fire this morning in Stockton. Rachel Wolf joins us live from Center Street with that. And also, as we're hearing from one of the people who was rescued in that fire, Rachel? That's right. We do know that two firefighters suffered minor, non life threatening injuries. One a dislocated shoulder, another had a shoulder injury to the muscle. They're both going to take the day off after fighting this five alarm blaze. This is the building that we're talking about. This is an old YMCA building here on North Center Street. It's three stories, as you can see. Firefighters tell us that the homeless like to get into this building to stay warm. Even though there is no cause of this fire, we're hearing that. There were people inside. In fact, when firefighters arrived on scene, there was a young lady on the second story screaming for help. And she tells us how she escaped with her life thanks to their help. I saw my life flash before my eyes a couple times. I've never been in a situation like this. Taylor tells us that she is homeless and that she was staying here last night, uh, this new year. She's probably not going to be staying here anymore. She's hopefully going to get some help and be staying somewhere warm. Again, this isn't the first time firefighters have been called out to this building. This has been a problem. Right now, they are actually boarding it up and making it safe, but structurally inside, one of the firefighters, that's why he got injured, he fell through the floor. So this is going to be a bit of an issue. They're going to take a second look at it structurally. The other fire that happened about two hours later, three hours later, was over on Country Club Boulevard. This is at an auto repair shop. It started at at the gas meter, we're told by investigators that fire spread from the meter and the gas line went up inside that auto body repair shop. It also spread to a building that was adjacent and they shared like a wall. And so that fire spread into that vacant storefront there. We're not sure the name of that business. Nobody in either business at the time when those fire when the when that fire broke out. So again, firefighters have been very, very busy when the temperature gets cold. People are seeking shelter in a lot of these abandoned buildings, trying to stay warm. And we don't know if that's the cause, but we do know that there were people inside here last night. Marianne.